Today I'm going to review with you what we're going to be doing for our final project. It won't be for a couple weeks, but I want you to be able to pick an animal within the next few days by Friday so that you know which animal you will be doing some research on. Our final project for animals will look like this. You'll have three boxes, you'll draw three pictures, and then you'll write three sentences. First, you need to pick an animal. Think about the different animals that you've learned about while listening to Miss Young's videos and my videos. You're going to pick one animal, you'll draw a picture, and you'll write a sentence. My animal is a whatever it is. Habitat. You'll draw a picture of the habitat that your animal lives in. Then you'll tell us. Uh, I'll just make this up. A cheetah lives in the grasslands. And then your last part will be diet. What does it eat? So then you'll draw a picture of the food that your animal eats and you'll write a sentence about it. So by Friday, I want you to pick one animal, any animal you want, and you'll have to look up those two facts about it. It's habitat, that's where it lives, and it's diet, what does it eat? So when you're watching a video, if you see an animal that looks interesting or an animal that you can already think of that you want to research, ask your helper or your family member at home to help you find either videos about it on YouTube or Discovery Education. You can use books. The library is now open, the public library. Uh, you can use magazines. So get some ideas of different animals. We want you to pick a wild animal. Do not pick a pet or livestock. So if you have horses in your backyard, try not to pick a horse because I want you to try to pick an animal maybe you don't know very much about using the focus of the habitats and what they eat because we've been learning about what animals need food, water, air, and shelter. Um, after you've picked your animal, you'll look up those different facts about it, and then in a couple weeks, we will write our sentences. So watch a couple more videos I have on here to get some ideas of an animal that you want to pick.